Hello everyone. Today we'll have a new lesson about empowerment technology. Empowering the world with the use of technology. We're so lucky because the technologies are present everywhere. It helps us to make our work quickly and accurate. It is time updated and always upgraded. In this generation, Technology has many uses and important role to our lives, and what we ought to do is to empower it by doing some things that have value or good benefit to us by the use of gadgets and computers. Empowerment technology or e-tech often deals with the use of different technologies such as mobile phones, telephones, computer and other devices to locate, save, communicate, and to inform. Empowerment technology is important for its innovative uses, is sufficient in our daily lives. There are three importance of empowerment technology, and these are for communication, to make our lives easier, and to help our country for its modernization plans. Empowerment technology is important for it is used as a source of communication. As years pass, lots of gadgets and other devices have improved its uses. Before, a cellular phone is only used for texting, calling, and playing simple games. Now, due to technology convergence or the way technology changes or evolves its system, a cellular phone is not just used for texting, calling, and playing simple games. It is now used for communicating people from other places by the use of the internet and applications or softwares such as Facebook, Messenger, Twitter, Viber, Kakotalk, and so on that is consistently being used by mostly every one of us. Without these applications or softwares, we cannot communicate every day with the people who are far from us. Since empowerment technology is well known among every one of us, communication with other people who are far from us will never be a problem anymore. Friendships that has been broken by distance has now been rebuilt through the use of empowerment technology. Empowerment technology is important since it makes our individual lives easier in different aspects such as for school matters, office, or work matters, and for our individual matters. Before, blackboards and whiteboards are one of the tools used in teaching students. Now, there are already LCD projectors that is being used by many institutions or schools nowadays. By the help of empowerment technology, teachers made their lives easier through the use of these projectors and the students as well made their lives easier in acquiring knowledge. E-Tech is not just useful for the school matters but it is also useful in an office or work matters and for personal matters as well. For example, when you are out to make a presentation, since technology has evolved, we already have this presentation software such as Microsoft Presentation, Prezi, Lotus Freelance Graphics, etc. Without this presentation softwares, we will all still be stuck onto those visual aid presentation. Empowerment technology doesn't just conserve time, but it can make our lives easier. Empowerment technology is important for it also helping our country for its modernization plans. We are now living in a world where everyone is upgrading its systems. It is called modernization. Empowerment technologies can help in modernization because it can strengthen our plans to be competitive with other countries by building up some new technologies for the betterment of our nation. 
Philippines has a potential on to be a competitive with other countries such as Finland, Japan, and United States, that its success toward the field of technology is far beyond what everyone expected. Empowerment technology is important, for without e-tech, it will hinder our future success in the field of technology. Empowerment technology is important especially to the millennials to prepare to teach the value and to introduce them or us to the proper world of ICT or information and communication technologies. And also, of course, to teach us the proper etiquette of using it and not the way where people use it in violence that could end up someone else's precious life. ICT or Information and Communications Technology or Technologies is an umbrella term that includes any communication device or application, encompassing radio, television, cellular phones, computer and network hardware and software, satellite systems, and so on, as well as the various services and applications associated with them such as video conferencing and distance learning. ICTs are often spoken of in a particular context, such as ICTs in education, healthcare, or libraries. The term is somewhat more common outside of the United States. That's all for the discussion about empowerment technology. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.